Oh God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in saecula saeculorum. Amen. Iam Christe sol justitie, mentis de iscante nepre, Virtutum ut lux redeat, te ristiem cum reparas, dans tempus acceptabile, et penitens cortribue, convertat ut beninitas, Quos longa sufert pietas, quidamque penitentiae, da fere quo fit demtio, maiore tu omune rei, culparum quam vis grandium. Dies venit dies tua, per quam re florent omnia, le temor in hac utue, per hanc reducti gratiae, te rerum universita, Clemens adoret Trinitas, et nos novi perveniam, novum canamus canticum. Amen. Create a clean heart in me, O God, Renew in me a steadfast spirit. Have mercy on me, God, in your kindness. In your compassion blot out my offense. Oh, wash me more and more from my guilt. And cleanse me from my sin. My offenses, truly I know them. My sin is always before me. Against you, you alone have I sinned. What is evil in your sight I have done. That you may be justified when you give sentence. And be without reproach when you judge. O oh, see, in guilt I was born, a sinner was I conceived. Indeed you love truth in the heart, then in the secret of my heart teach me wisdom. O oh, purify me, then I shall be clean. O oh, wash me, I shall be whiter than snow. Make me hear rejoicing and gladness, that the bones you have crushed may revive. From my sins turn away your face, and blot out all my guilt. A pure heart create for me, O God, put a steadfast spirit within me. Do not cast me away from your presence, nor deprive me of your Holy Spirit. Give me again the joy of your help, with a spirit of fervor sustain me, that I may teach transgressors your ways, and sinners may return to you. 
rescue me, God, my helper, and my tongue shall ring out your goodness. O Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. For in sacrifice you take no delight, burnt offering from me you would refuse. My sacrifice, a contrite spirit, a humbled contrite heart you will not spurn. In your goodness show favor to Zion, rebuild the walls of Jerusalem. Then you will be pleased with lawful sacrifice, holocausts offered on your altar. Gloria Patri et Filio, et Spiritui Sancto. Sicut erat in principio, et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Create a clean heart in me, O God. Renew in me a steadfast spirit. Rejoice, Jerusalem, for through you all men will be gathered to the Lord. Let all men speak of the Lord's majesty and sing his praises in Jerusalem. O Jerusalem, holy city, he scourged you for the works of your hands, but will again pity the children of the righteous. Praise the Lord for his goodness, and bless the King of the ages, so that his tent may be rebuilt in you with joy. May he gladden within you all who were captives, all who were ravaged, may he cherish within you for all generations to come. A bright light will shine to all parts of the earth. Many nations shall come to you from afar, and the inhabitants of all the limits of the earth, drawn to you by the name of the Lord God, bearing in their hands their gifts for the King of heaven. Every generation shall give joyful praise in you, and shall call you the Chosen One through all ages forever. Go then rejoice over the children of the righteous, who shall all be gathered together, and shall bless the Lord of the ages. Happy are those who love you, and happy those who rejoice in your prosperity. Happy are all the men who shall grieve over you, over all your chastisements. For they shall rejoice in you, as they behold all your joy forever. My spirit blesses the Lord, the great King. Gloria Patri et Filio, et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio, et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Rejoice, Jerusalem, for through you all men will be gathered to the Lord. Zion, praise your God, who sent his word to renew the earth. Oh, praise the Lord, Jerusalem. Zion, praise your God. He has strengthened the bars of your gates. He has blessed the children within you. He established peace on your borders. He feeds you with finest wheat. He sends out his word to the earth and swiftly runs his command. He showers down snow white as wool. He scatters hoar frost like ashes. 
He hurls down hailstones like crumbs. The waters are frozen at his touch. He sends forth his word and it melts them. At the breath of his mouth, the waters flow. He makes his word known to Jacob. To Israel his laws and decrees. He has not dealt thus with other nations. He has not taught them his decrees. Gloria patria et filio et spiritu sancto. Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper. Et in secula seculorum. Amen. Zion, praise your God, who sent his word to renew the earth. Through his suffering, my servant shall justify many, and their guilt he shall bear. Therefore I will give him a portion among the great, and he shall divide the spoils with the mighty, because he surrendered himself to death and was counted among the wicked, and he shall take away the sins of many and win pardon for their offenses. God himself will set me free from the hunter's snare. God himself will set me free from the hunter's snare. From those who would trap me with lying words and from the hunter's snare. Gloria Patria et Filio et Spiritui Sancto. God himself will set me free from the hunter's snare. When you meet those who are in need of clothing, do not turn away from them, for they are your brothers. Then your light shall break forth like the dawn, and your good deeds shall go before you. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to his people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of his servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear, holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Gloria Patria et Filio, et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. When you meet those who are in need of clothing, do not turn away from them, for they are your brothers. Then your light shall break forth like the dawn, and your good deeds shall go before you. Let us pray to Christ our Savior, who redeemed us by his death and resurrection, 
O Lord, have mercy on us. You went up to Jerusalem to suffer and so enter into your glory. Bring your church to the Passover feast of heaven. O Lord, have mercy on us. You were lifted high on the cross and pierced by the soldier's lance. Heal our wounds. O Lord, have mercy on us. You made the cross the tree of life. Give its fruit to those reborn in baptism. O Lord, have mercy on us. On the cross you forgave the repentant thief. Forgive us our sins. O Lord, have mercy on us. Pater noster qui es in celis, sanctificetur nomen tuum, adveniat regnum tuum, Fiat voluntas tua, sicut in cielo et in terra, panem nostrum quotidianum da nobis hodie, et dimite nobis debita nostra, sicut et nos dimitimus debitoribus nostris, et ne nos intucas in tentationem, sed libera nos amalo. Show gracious favor, O Lord, we pray, to the works of penance we have begun, that we may have strength to accomplish with sincerity the bodily observances we undertake. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Dominus nos benedicat et ab omni malo defendat et ad vitam perducat eternam. Amen.